Hey there everyone, I'm David. And I'm Angelique. And we are Adventures, Adventures on, on Deck. Deck. All right, so this is our first video ever. Um, we've been talking about doing this for a long time. So we're just gonna start off with an introduction video so you guys can understand uh, who we are. All right, so as I said, my name is David. Um, so I'm from Delaware originally. Uh, we do both currently live in San Antonio, Texas now. Uh, I've been here for about six years. She's been here her entire life. Um, we started cruising in 2019 uh, in September, um, soon before the pandemic and then fell in love with it so much and then kind of couldn't go anymore because um, of COVID. So it's been a while. Um, we were able to finally get on a cruise again uh, a few months ago. Um, we're actually going again next month. We'll tell you guys more about that later. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit about me. And I'm Angelique and uh, yeah, born and raised in Texas, uh, but didn't actually start cruising until 2019. So um, it was one of those things though, that as soon as we started, we just fell in love with it and have just hit the ground running from there. We have a full house at home, four kids. Um, his parents live with us as well, which mm -hmm. is awesome. Um, and that means that we get to sneak away on cruises together yeah. while Grammy and Grandpa hold down the fort. So mm -hmm. that's always fun. Um, but yeah, I, I think really what this is about is sharing our love of cruising, mm -hmm. um, tips, tricks, things that we've learned along the way, um, especially as we had nothing but YouTube videos to keep us occupied during COVID. Yeah. <laughs> and we decided that this was something that we wanted to share with everyone. Yeah, and just to go over our experiences as well. So we wanted to be able to share our experience and document that, um, you know, whether, you know, there's three people watching or nobody sees it at all like to us, it's more about just um, being able to document our experiences and be able to share them with, you know, family and friends and things like that. And um, yeah. we'll see where things go from there, but that's kind of what we wanted to start with doing. And we'll also, like you said, offer some tips and, um, and, and some tricks that we've come across as we've kind of, uh, you know, continue to cruise. And also we, we, we watch, so many videos we've seen a ton of stuff so we feel like we've been on um 50 cruises by this point yeah. um, because of how much time we spend just watching cruise videos and ship walkthroughs and all types of different things so um we feel like we've been on a lot more cruises than we've actually <laughs> been on uh, we've only been on two up to this point um like i said we have a third one booked for um about three weeks from now mm -hmm. um we'll be on the carnival breeze sailing out of galveston um, on uh, October the 11th. So um, that's our next cruise coming up. We're looking forward to it. And that one, we're getting to take two of the four kids with us. We are, so it'll be their first time cruising. Yeah. Um, they haven't been with us before. So it'll be really nice for them to see, um, you know, what the cruise is really like. They've seen obviously a lot of videos and things like that, um, but they'll get to see it in person finally. So that'll be, that'll be really nice. So uh, one thing we wanted to talk about in this video is why we love cruising. And I think, for me, one of the greatest things that I enjoy about cruising is just all of the people, not just from the people that you meet while you're waiting in the terminal, getting ready mm -hmm. to get onto the ship and, and throughout your entire cruise and vacation, uh, but also the crew. Uh, what I love about getting to meet different crew members is the different countries that they come from, from Indonesia, India, Mm -hmm. um, it, it's it's amazing you do see people from Russia and you get to hear about traditions and things that you you've never seen in person um, but what I, I find fascinating is the way that the crew interact with the guests yeah. um, because at least for us our room stewards have always felt like they're family like they mm -hmm. just they're so excited to get to give us a little bit of their positive energy and, and let us enjoy our vacation. Um, and so anytime that you get an opportunity to talk to the crew and ask them where they're from, yeah. ask about their families and what their interests are. And uh, it, it's just a really way, neat way to connect with people. Yeah, for me, I mean, to me, that's my favorite part. I'm, I'm a very shy kind of introverted person around people that I don't know typically. Um, but um, once, I've, once I'm on a cruise ship, especially once I've had a couple of drinks, uh, I definitely, I'm a lot more social. Um, and so I and I tend to meet a lot of people on the cruise ships. It's, it's something that we kind of noticed um, on our first trip is that I just kind of started talking to everybody um, and just having a lot of fun and just getting to know people and having a good time and joking around with them. And it's really funny because you'll see people, you know, the first day of sailing 
and then you'll run into them, you know, a couple of days later or... Um, See them in the elevator. <laughs> right, right. And we've got so many stories about those kind of things that we'll get into details more about later on, but uh, not in this video, but in, in, pre in, in future videos. But um, you know, it's a lot of fun getting to do all of that. And, you know, this isn't a, a tip video here because we're going to do those later on. But one tip that I will say just as of right now is just get to know the crew. Start talking to the crew, ask them questions, um, learn more about them. And I think that that makes the cruising experience um, even more rewarding when you get to understand and learn about these people um, who are working so hard to make your adventure um, so memorable. Uh, it's, it's not possible without the crew. You can have all the best food and all the best, you know, the greatest ships and the biggest ships and all that stuff in the world. Um, but if the crew don't do what they do, uh, none of that matters. And so uh, we've been uh, really honored to have amazing crew from, like she said, the room stewards, um, the, our wait staff at the, at the restaurants that we've gone to have been amazing. Um, bartenders have been great. Like we've had such great, the entertainment has been amazing. So I mean, we've dealt with a lot of different crew members on the ship and they've all been absolutely phenomenal. So, um, you know, without them, none of this makes any sense. So that's the biggest shout out that I think I would have is just the crew is just absolutely phenomenal um, on every ship that we've been on. Uh, the other thing that we really like about cruising is the, I guess just the sticker shock in a good way, <laughs> right. in a good way, right. because there's so much that people don't think about when you mm -hmm. think about vacations um, that is included in the price of the cruise from your yeah. room and board, your food, your entertainment, all of that is included. Right. So once you start adding up hotel visits right. and trips to McDonald's and whatever, it, it adds up. Yeah, and let's assume you go to McDonald's. I mean, like, <laughs> right. I, I don't, we don't do that very often. So for us, I mean, if we're going to a restaurant, you know, we, we have a, a large family. So for all of us to go out to eat, it's extremely expensive. Um, and so when you add that up, when you're going on a cruise, you know, with all of that food being yeah. included, you know, obviously besides the specialty restaurants and that kind of thing, but um, there's so much food that's included. Um, it's actually a lot cheaper than you think. And so it's yeah. funny, we, we didn't cruise for a long time. I would wanted to um, years ago, but I think that um, we saw that big number and thought that, you know, that was really expensive. But once we realized what it all included um, and then we were fortunate enough to have friends of ours who finally convinced us to go um, and uh, we went with them on our first cruise, had an amazing time. It was oh, yeah. definitely um, not as expensive as we thought it was going to be. Um, and so now we're just... We're hooked. We're hooked. We're hooked. That's for it. For sure. So one other thing we wanted to do in this video was to uh, just recognize a few of the YouTubers that we watched and, and um, really helped us to learn a lot about cruising. Mm -hmm. uh, we spent a ton of time, like hours a day, watching you guys um, each and every day during the pandemic when we couldn't cruise and we were so addicted to cruising and we couldn't go. And um, you guys, we went back and watched a lot of your older videos, obviously of when, you know, cruising was still going on and things like that. So um, a couple of people I want to mention, this isn't everybody by any means, but no. um, a few of them, um, um, Cruising with Don, I watch his videos quite a bit. Um, and then Emma Cruises, Emma's amazing. Um, so I mean, those She's are more European, right? She's yeah, yeah, European absolutely, cruises. yeah. But so, but still, I mean, there's a lot of good tips and tricks. Oh, she yeah. brings up a lot of in her like British isms of the. Of the <laughs> She's great. She's so fun. Emma's amazing. Definitely check those guys out. But um, yeah, like just watching that and getting to getting to learn more about cruising and seeing what they enjoy and and learning tips and tricks from them and being able to implement that on our trips, um, really, really helped us get through the time where we couldn't cruise. Mm -hmm. um, so that's a few for me. I know you had some as well. Um, I know para DJ. Mm -hmm. uh, they they like to sail. I think Carnival a lot more than yeah, anything else. Yeah, I think they're on Carnival mostly. Um, which is spoiler. That's the cruise line that we've <laughs> really found ourselves fitting in with. Yeah, and we'll um, talk more about why in a, yeah. a future video. But and then um, EECC Travels. Yeah, um, they were a lot of fun. In fact, um, she gave the idea. She gave me the idea about gift bags um, mm -hmm. for the stewards. Mm -hmm. So we'll talk about that in another video as well. But um, great tips, great yeah, tips, and absolutely. family oriented too, so that yeah, you can enjoy a cruise just the two of you, or here's how to do it, you know, and take care of the whole family. Yeah, and number one for both of us, I think, is uh, Tony and Jenny with Lely to Loca. Like yeah. those, you guys are phenomenal. I, I watch more of your videos, I think, than yeah. anything else ever, yeah, like we look even TV to shows. Every day. <laughs> yeah, um, I, I probably I've watched countless. Um, 
um, you know, Lolita Loco videos. So thank you guys so much. You guys are absolutely phenomenal. Um, and then honestly, Tony is the guy that, um, without even knowing, I've, I've never talked to Tony. I don't know Tony at all, but just from watching his videos, um, he's what really inspired me to kind of make this channel in the first place. I'm mm -hmm. um, just going back and watching some of the things that he um, was doing and how he started out and going back to like even like his first videos and things like that. Yeah. Um, and then kind of just watching the progression over the last, uh, I think it's about three or four years or so now that he's been yeah. doing it. So, um, you know, shout out to you, Tony. Shout out to all you guys. And even and there's plenty of others that we didn't mention either, mm -hmm. but um, shout out to all of you guys. But those are some of the ones we watch the most. So I wanted to thank you guys um, for helping us get here and helping them to get us through the pandemic of watching you guys right. and do all your videos. Um, we really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for that. Absolutely. Um, I think that's about it for us today. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, comments, leave them in the comment section below. Uh, anything that you would like to see from us, questions about maybe our favorite ports or mm -hmm. anything you can think of, we'd be happy to uh, get some interaction going. So. Absolutely. Yeah. So, all right, guys. Till next time, we are Adventures on Deck, and we'll see you guys later. See you around. Bye.